So I have a customer today interested in a, you know, Subaru BRZ. So I go outside and one of my fellow colleagues left the light on inside the, the interior, right? So I had to jump it. Well, after you jump the car, you have to drive it a little bit to make sure the battery stays intact. So I guess I'll have to take a little stroll in this guy right here. Woe is me, woe is me, woe is me. I guess I'll have to do it. Oh no, life is not so great. Gotta drive a little sports car. What am I gonna do? So the first thing I noticed when I got in this is it does have some key features. So it has a snow mode, a track mode. Let's get the paddle shifters, boom, boom. You know what I mean? This is great. You get the steering wheel adjuster because this thing gets way too low. All right, here we go. Let's put that up. Um, seating for four if the other two people don't have legs. Um, if you know any legless people, that's awesome for them. I think that now we have something going on here. Other than that, I'm going to see how it drives. Big screen for a backup camera. I'll tell you that much. Look at all that visibility. You know? So right away I noticed this steering wheel is tight. Great driving experience, sports car. I'm not even in track mode yet. Got these cool little things here, boom. At a stoplight and I'm thinking, should I just put it in track mode and see how it goes? I think so. Not a lot of spots to hold my camera, so I'm trying to be safe, efficient. This car is nice, very tight, very responsive. Very small. A lot of fun in this car. Even the dog knows. Overall, guys, what a great, fun car to drive. Uh, you know, why wouldn't it be? Subaru, boxer motor. It's really, uh, you know, tight corners and just a great little sports car if that's something you're looking for. So. Come check one out for yourself. This is an automatic. The manuals are very hard to get these days, um, but I'd be more than happy to help you out. Oh.